again, everybody. I'm back, and I told you I'd make a second recipe tonight. Um, this is going to be um, macaroni salad, and it's very quick and easy to make. Uh, the longest part is only going to be to cook your um, elbow macaroni noodles, and everything else is very easy. I'm taking uh, plain whole milk yogurt. I have a little bit left, that's why I'm making this. I want to use this up. And I scrape it into a bowl, just like this. I have very little bit left. I'm going to try to scrape it all out of there. But that's all I have. That's all I have left, so that's how much I'm going to use. And uh, what I like to do with this is to add in regular, already made um, buttermilk ranch dressing. Just a little bit, not too much. I prefer to make my own, but uh, I have this and I need to use what I have. So I'm using this ranch dressing that I bought from the store. And I mix that in with the yogurt, and it really makes a really tangy um, uh, dressing for this. And I like to uh, heat it up just a little bit with spice, not with with uh, the stove. But I will take, uh, let's see, I've got a spoon nearby. I don't. I've got a little wooden spoon here I'll use. And I just take and shake in hot curry powder. And it has a mix. It's hot madras uh, curry powder, which has coriander, turmeric, uh, mustard, chili, bengal brown, uh, cumin, fenugreek, pepper, garlic, salt, fennel, poppy seeds, and curry leaves. And that's uh, made into a, uh, ground into a curry powder. And you can buy that at any um, Indian store. Also, this is a uh, green chili chutney. And it's mainly um, processed uh, green chilies and coriander. This is very, very hot, but very good. And it's a green paste. And I put that in like that. And then I will mix this together just like this. So everything's mixed very well. And next I will take imitation crab meat, or you can use real uh, crab meat. No crab meat would probably be the best, but I'm ripping this into little threads like this to distribute through the salad, just like this. And I would normally probably use about um, maybe three or four of these, maybe more. I only have two left, so again, we're using up things that I have a uh, little bit of, I, I can't make other things, but I can make this with that uh, leftovers. And be sure to add all this. Next, all you do is, is uh, mix the crab in real good like this. Take your cooked pasta that Again, not cooked mushy. It's uh, firm, but not crunchy. Sort of chewy. And I mix this. And you can put green onions. Chop up green onions and put them in there. Olives, if you'd like. Um, I don't have any. So that's why I'm not doing that. And, and um, it tastes just as good. And there, when it comes out, you can garnish with green onions and um, 
you can refrigerate this. You have to refrigerate it after if there's any left over. But I like it when it's first mixed like this. And it's so good and spicy and different. And I made that with just a few things I had around the house and to use up my yogurt. So I hope you try this and enjoy it. Uh, that's all for this evening. I'm Clyde in Jacksonville, Florida. I hope you all have a great weekend. Take care. Good night.